Prism Dark Golf. Everything you need to know. For... Hey everybody, this is Sunglass Rob from Sport RX, and I'm here with our in-house Oakley brand ambassador, Andrew, to talk about Prism Dark Golf, maybe one of the best lenses ever in the history of time. I think you could definitely argue that. I love this lens. So I got the opportunity to test this lens on a golf course in Vail with Oakley and this Prism experience that we did. And I was there with a bunch of people who play a lot of golf and don't play a lot of golf and know a lot about Oakley and don't know a lot about Oakley and getting people's reaction to this lens was pretty amazing. It's crazy how you can see all of the brown in the grass. I love it. Yeah. I love it. So far, like I didn't take my sunglasses off once. They're amazing. It's almost like x-ray vision. It is. It does kind of feel yeah. like that. It does, yeah. yeah. What I could see now, the big difference, it's like, so the grass here, especially on the green, it's kind of like there's like different texture of green and yeah. brown. Yeah. And I could really see like the little pocket that is different. It makes you understand the grass a little better, which is cool. I feel like it does kind of everything you want a pair of golf glasses to do. And then some, and then right? Some, because yeah. you even use it for other activities. Yeah, so actually, we'll get, we'll get into that for sure. I definitely like this lens for a multitude of activities. Hey, by the way, if you like other activities, and if you like Oakley, and if you like Prism, and if you just like Andrew, you can subscribe to our channel. We have lots of content on all kinds of Oakley stuff. And also, real quick, um, it's hard to talk about Prism Dark Golf without talking about regular Oakley Prism. We'll get into that a little bit, but we have a full comparison video just on the differences and similarities, so check that out as well. Okay, so Prism Dark Golf stemmed from some people finding Prism Golf not to be dark enough, right? Exactly. So how? Exactly. what's the VLT on this, which is visual light transmission, basically how dark the lens is? So VLT on Dark Golf is 22% versus Golf, which is 30. Yeah. So you have less light coming in through the lens to your eyes. And we have a separate comparison review you can check out. Yeah, so the Dark Golf lens is I think the name is a little confusing because it's still not a dark lens. For golf, what you want is more pop and less stop. You don't want lenses that are overly dark. You definitely don't want neutral gray lenses. And in our opinion, probably don't want polarized lenses for golf either. So this kind of lens fits into that category perfectly. It's a really nice, warm, rose lens color. Gives you amazing contrast off the green. But on top of that, this has prism lens technology where Oakley actually, with the use of different dyes is able to manipulate the light spectrum and stop certain light colors coming in at certain frequencies to then enhance boost other uh, colors basically it's going to let you read the greens as well as possible it's going to give you as much contrast as you can have while still cutting out all the glare and all the brightness that you need so this lens was really intended for um, being playing golf and maybe a little bit brighter environment on a sunny day where you where you think you might want a dark gray lens, you really don't. This rose lens with a little bit of the iridium, black iridium coating is just kind of perfect. Um, just the warm, nice color, not too dark, not too light, just, just wakes things up as much as it needs, but has a lot of protection as well. I think it's kind of like a perfect lens. It is. It's a it's a great option. Again, especially if you live in a sunnier environment, you yeah. don't want a little bit more protection from the sun. And I think you touched on this earlier, but that boost in contrast really helps you to read the different textures in the greens as well as track the ball. Yeah, it really helps track the ball as well. A lot of times when you when you look up there, it's just you you lose it. And with this rose color and with the prism technology, you can see the ball really well. Um, and if you really need to see the ball really well, they come in prescription. Yes, you can get Prism Dark Golf actual authentic Oakley lenses in prescription. Probably the two most popular pairs that we have are the ones we're wearing. That's the Flak 2.0 XL. Uh, Andrew's wearing the limited edition exclusive Sport RX color in the matte carbon. And I got on the Target line, which um, is a golf specific frame. 
and this is a golf specific lens, but let's break away just really quick. I actually am in love with this lens for many, many other things. If you're an old school Oakley person, if you're an Oakley fan, if you're an Oakley head out there, and you're used to and love the old VR28 Black Iridium, this is basically the new VR28 Black Iridium with Prism technology. It has that warm rose lens. It has that little bit of Iridium. It's like I just hyped up VR28 Black Iridium. I actually wear this frame with these lenses, even though they're golf specific for mountain biking a lot here in Southern California. Um, I ride Black Mountain a lot and it's really exposed and open and bright and um, not a lot of tree cover and uh, sometimes the other prism lenses aren't quite enough sun protection so I'm loving this lens a lot of people are finding this a great just general purpose lens as well mm -hmm. yeah. yeah yeah I think there's a lot of versatility to it I mean especially in a frame like the target line yeah so if you have any more questions about this lens if you're not sure if it's right for you you can actually pick up the phone I know old school you know those phones in your the computers in your pocket you can call people it's a thing um, you can call sport rx we have real live opticians here that know a lot Lot about Oakley Prism and can figure out which is the perfect setup for you for your golf game or for your sport or what you're doing so don't be afraid to call us and uh, if you have any other questions and you want to put in the comment section Andrew will reply I got you